Hello, welcome to quantitative reasoning solution section. And today we have quantitative reasoning from Lant and Step Book 5, page 100, test 19. Thank you for joining in today. All right, so we're going to be looking at this problem. Uh, to our new viewers, kindly subscribe to this channel for more quantitative reasoning solutions and problems. And to our subscribers thank you for staying with us do well to like share with your friends all right so we have here we have four three eight seven thirteen and here we have seven and eight eleven six fifteen five and nine all right so uh this particular solution is coming from a request a uh, from the comment section from one of the uh, previously posted solution uh, quantitative problems okay so we have this so let's work on the work with the middle number first to find seven that's the middle seven let me indicate so what are we going to do we're going to add the entire numbers outside 13 plus 4 plus 3 plus eight plus seven and when you add all you were going to have 35 okay so we're going to introduce an imaginary number which is five so 35 divided by five is seven okay so let's try the same for this to find nine we just have one nine here, so we don't need to indicate that. So we're going to add five plus eight plus eleven plus six plus fifteen. Okay. And we're going to have here we're going to have forty five. Okay. So we're going to have forty five divided by our imaginary five, which is and we're going to have nine. Right, so let's work with uh, the outer number. Let's try to find the numbers outside. So let's start with 8. So to find 8, we're going to have uh, 13 plus 4 plus 3 plus 7. Remember the 7 outside. And when we add all together, we have 27 right so what we're going to do is to multiply our imaginary five by the middle seven which is 35 right and after we have done that we're going to subtract 35 minus 27 here and when we subtract we're going to have our eight okay so don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel so let's go to the next number to find 13 We're going to add the numbers outside except the 13. So 4 plus 3 plus 8 plus 7, right? And when we add all, we're going to have 22. So remember to multiply your middle number by 5. And we're going to have 35, right? So 35 minus 22 going to have a 13 okay so to find let's find four okay so to find four we're going to add 13 plus 3 plus 8 plus 7 and we have our 31 so our 5 times 7 is 35 so 35 minus 31 we have a uh, four right so let's look at the next number we found our uh, four our uh, 13 our uh, eight and the middle seven so let's find number three so let's use this side to find three so to find three we're going to add as well 13 plus four plus eight plus 7, which is 32, right? 7 times 
that's the middle 7 times 5 is 35. 35 minus 32 is 3. And the next is number 7, the outer 7. So to find 7, the outer 7, we're going to have uh, 13 plus 4 plus 8 plus 3. And when we add up, we're going to have 28, All right? So 7 times the, out, the middle 7 right now times 5 is 35. 35 minus 28, we're going to have a 7, all right? So that is it for this. So when you try this method with the second example and the problem given in the text, you will definitely get the right answer. All right, do well to like, subscribe to this channel for more quantitative reasoning solutions and problems. Bye for now.